Muffin here. Welcome back. Doing a subscriber request. I had done something with insects for something else, and I can't remember exactly what it is, but I had another uh, subscriber request that was kind of a branch off from that, uh, which was cockroaches versus refrigerators. Um, kind of go hand in hand, just being that cockroaches kind of gross as they are, they end up being in, I don't know, I. They're known for being in the kitchen a lot, and so now these two are gonna go head to head in a battle of the cockroaches versus the refrigerators. This one is a bit interesting because the E25 is a tier seven tank destroyer uh, with no turret, the KV-2 being a tier six, but has a turret, and as we've, and you might have experienced before, turrets have a huge advantage. These KV-2s have <laughs> themselves all kind of stuck in this one position. The E-25s are able to do a ton of damage. I mean, just look at this. Just almost completely deleting these KV-2s super fast. However, if they get hit, once it's gonna really take a lot of hit points out of them. Now E25 with uh, about 1,060 hit points, I think a max roll on even using their HE is 1,000 hit points. So they may still survive after a hit, but they're gonna be uh, very, very low on hit points. So luckily that wasn't a penetrating HE round. We had, let's see, two, four, so we had six KV-2s versus five, that's right, five E-25s in this one. And the E-25 seemed to be just deleting these KV-2s pretty fast so two not was able to survive two non-penetrating he shots impressive so next round we're gonna do another two we're gonna do another um we're gonna add another kv2 to uh the kv team to see if the e25s can still do it so great shot off there on the kv22 these two tanks almost couldn't be more opposite from each other. You've got one that's much slower, one that's really fast, one with turret, one with no turret, one with uh, derp, one with not, no derp, one that's yeah, accurate, one that's not accurate, so they almost couldn't be more different. Almost like how cockroaches and refrigerators are, right? Okay, so that was the first round. And I want to thank Garen once again so much for helping to put these uh, videos together. Also, Ukulele Bob, um, doing it as well, been a big help. Uh, he has a YouTube channel, subscribe to him. I do have, uh, when he does help, uh, the link to his channel below. Getting into some pretty good effective positions. You can do this as well, especially knowing your Ooh, great, great shot there. Wow, those cockroaches just coming in hot. Now you can do this knowing that the entire enemy team is the same. They're all KV-2s. You can kind of know or predict where they're going to be and how to approach them. This guy's got a little bit of his lower plate exposed. Needing to do a little bit of side scraping there. Now this one, I, oh, I okay, so it's this. It's we've got six E25s versus seven KV2s. I think we are trying it with. Uh, just adding in some more players, but we're gonna we're gonna in the next round have two extra KV2s. That's what it is. <laughs> Just look at how much taller the KV2 is to the E25 is just so low to the ground. Thank you. 
Man, just crazy. The refrigerator is able to take out two of the cockroaches. Alright, so we're going to give the KV-2 team one extra and see how the cockroaches still do. Do you think they can still win? We'll find out here in the next round. All right, last one. So we've got five versus seven. And I know playing that KV-2 sometimes, that really long reload can be quite painful. Let's see if they'll finally be able to smash these bugs. That is one thing I really like about faster tanks, is just being able to get to those crucial positions so much faster. Little need for speed action there, getting uh, some air off the hills. Pretty epic. Oh, getting some of these KV-2s in a real bad position. We have one, oh, there he is. Maybe he just, his internet was out a little bit. So, being that the E25s were easily able to win when they had one extra, now the KV-2s. Okay, one E25 down. E25's going into town here, which honestly is a much better place for the KV-2. Doesn't have great gun depression, not very good accuracy. Being in the town, it forces the E25 to fight more close range, and the fact they don't have turrets. Ouch. Yeah, they are just bleeding hit points, so very, very smart move when the KV-2 is going town in this uh, situation. Just deleted another cockroach. Okay, well, KV-2 is doing a little bit better. There was 3v3. Oh, now there's 2v2. Will the refrigerators make a comeback? Oh. <laughs> oh, no. The bounce, and especially with something so derpy, this is not, not good. There's still two more to go. Oh, man. Well, I want to thank all my subscribers for participating, helping out in this. You guys are all awesome. You guys are what makes the channel. This is The Muffin here. You guys stay cool and keep tanking.